Hi, Yao G here and welcome to our latest Disney Infinity video. I've just loaded the game up and to my amazement there's been another update. I say amazement as the game's being cancelled, but they've updated to 3.00. So I'm going to do this video a little bit unusual. I would go ahead and show you everything that's been implemented, but I'm actually going to show you what's not been implemented before we go to what has been. So we're going to the Disney Infinity Collection and of course you'd expect to see the new Mad Hatter, Alice and Time and maybe some Dory characters but there is nothing. None of them have been implemented as yet. Okay, the Dory stuff's coming out next month so we've got about six weeks, maybe five weeks till that comes out. But Alice and, and the Mad Hatter and Time are supposedly coming out next week in about 10 days time so it seems or less than that it seems a little odd that they aren't there in the character roster I can only assume as with the last update that maybe tomorrow we'll get another update and there'll be a few more things in there so that's one of the things that aren't in there also there's no new power discs as you can see <laughs> Nothing new for the 3.0 characters or the power disc or the playset in the character roster. And into the toy box now. And I've got to be honest, I was hoping for something special. If you've seen my channel, we do a lot of boss fights. And the first thing I wanted to test out and see what was going on was, have we got a new boss? Have they done it? Have they listened to every Disney Infinity player around the globe? and implemented Kylo Ren into the AI boss roster. Well, there's only one way to find out. Let's throw in a boss fight spawner. We'll go into spark mode. We'll wait for it to actually kick into action properly. And we'll check its properties. And we'll see who's on the roster. Now before, I think there was 12 time being the final one we've got the normal ones and we'll scroll down and venom green goblin venom time is the next one hang on a minute hang on a minute they've deleted time i'm not being funny they've not implemented any new bosses but what they have done is deleted the ai boss time little bit odd can't quite understand the reckoning or the reasoning behind that yes he was a bit of an odd boss he had absolutely no defense but you know you've, you've created him you've put him in the game some people are having fun with him personally i got a bit of a thing going where we were trying to defeat him in a specific time that's all gone but for my subscribers i have actually checked my uh, my arena with the time boss luckily i left the time boss set as default and even though he's been deleted from the game I can load that toy box up and the time boss still is there. So those battles will continue. Thumbs up for that one. Thumbs down for Disney. But who knows? Maybe in the next couple of days they'll, they'll update again. As I say, the Alice stuff isn't there. So maybe they'll put time back in. And maybe it'll be tweaked so he's a little bit better and got some defense. Who knows? Time will tell. Pardon the pun. So the next thing to check out is actually what they have put in the game. And... We'll jump into the toy store for that one. So straight away when you jump into the toy store, you'll notice that they've given the new stuff its own tab. Again, there seems to be nothing. I've had a little look through. I could be wrong. Don't hold me to it. But as far as I can work out, there's nothing for the Alice stuff, which again is coming out in less than 10 days, finding that odd. But like I so say, they have given the Dory place at its own tap, like they did with the Battleground stuff, which I think is cool. Saves you having to trawl through every single page of the toy store to find every single piece of the Dory place set. Because there is so much to go through. But in the Dory place set, there seems to be a nice amount of new stuff. There's five whole pages to go through. So what I'm going to do, I'm not going to go through every single thing individually. I'll just scroll through them slowly. And if you want to take a little better look at them then you can pause it and and read away some of them are breakables it looks like we've got a a theme terrain there which would be nice we can build our own toy boxes and the skyscape of which we've got two which looks pretty awesome onto the second page and i'm hoping i mean i've heard rumors 
whether they be true or not, but originally they were saying that when the Nemo figure comes out, I think it's middle of next month, that they were going to release him, unusually, which sounds so cool, with the 1.0 play disc or power disc from the Nemo set. And then I heard a rumour that they were deciding not to. So, who knows? Who knows? That one's up in the air. But they have got some really cool-looking stuff. I mean, if you're into building a themed toy box, sometimes you're a little bit limited on the amount of stuff. The Battlegrounds wasn't overly amazing. But there's a heck of a lot of coral and sea stuff here. I really hope you can fly, float through the air like as if you're under the water. Really hope they get that right. They've they've never actually done a Nemo playset, so this is a first. And the water effect's going to be a big thing. We've always wanted decent-looking water, so it's going to be interesting to see how good they get it. But there we have it. So that's the end of the fifth page. Looks like we've got quite a lot of Dory stuff, no Alice stuff, and they've deleted the time boss. So what are we going to do? I'm guessing there's going to be an update. But there we go, guys. That pretty much covers everything i found in the new 3.00 update that came out today. I hope you enjoyed taking a quick look at it. I do hope to see you in the next, and bye for now.